Hey Cancer, Rising Storm here. So I'm going to be doing a general love reading for the month of August 2021. Keep in mind that these are general readings. Take what applies. Feel free to switch storylines however you like, alright? So I'm going to be looking into your overall view. Your energy is Cancer, the person that you're dealing with, right? Why is it all happening and the possible outcome from now until the end of August 2021? What is going on with my Cancers in regards to their love lives? Please give me an overall view. Two cards for Cancer, two cards for the person that you're dealing with, and why is it all happening here? All right, let's see what's happening. So you got the Six of Cups. There's there's a theme from the past here. It's past eight, past uh, past life soulmates. Okay, but there's somebody from the past here that you've been thinking about, or you there's going down memory lane. There's blocks of communication, and I feel like you're waiting. Okay, so there's no communication right now between you and the person that you're dealing with, and it has to do with someone from the past, okay, that you've been thinking a lot about, or they've been thinking about you, okay, with that Six of Cups there. You got the Eight of Wands in reverse, and you got the Three of Wands there, so I feel like right now there's no communication, or there's blocks in communication. You can literally be blocked, and I feel like right now you're waiting for your ships to come in, or you're waiting from some sort of contact from this individual here. Okay, so that's just the top. Your person has the page of pentacles. You could be dealing with someone who is younger than you. Okay, doesn't have to be, or at least immature, or the way they come off. I don't know. Could be a third party situation for some of you, or it doesn't, you know, I don't know. But your person has the three of pentacles. So they do want to collaborate with you, or they do want to at least be on the same page with you and communicate with you, or at least be somewhat cordial with one another. Okay, more like friendly. Why is it happening? The seven of swords. So <coughs> there's some sort of, I don't know. We'll see what's going on there. It could be like sneakiness, or some. there's some something about not being honest, or some sort of deception here. Why is the six of cups? Tell me about the Six of Cups, please, for the overall view. Why is the Six of Cups here? And the Six of Swords? Yeah, there's someone from the past that you can't get over or you just cannot let go of. Alright, are you wanting them to come back around or you want to come back around? So there's a strong connection that you have with someone and it's it's like it's hard for you to move on from them. So it's like you think about you think about them all the time, the past memories or whatever the case may be. You could deal could be dealing with an air sign. All right, so tell me about this Eight of Wands in reverse. What is this Eight of Wands in reverse about? What is this Eight of Wands in reverse about? <sighs> There's a third part. There's more than one person surrounding this whole mix here. There's just too many. Okay. So there's even though there's blocks in communication, I feel like you do emotionally want to you do want to connect with this person. There's something about emotionally connecting with them or you want to reunite with them you want to see them but there's blocks in communication so why is this three of wands here tell me about the three of wands what is this three of wands about what is this three of wands about in the world in reverse because you feel like there there's the the situation is not finished between the two of you you don't feel like there's there's no closure here you're waiting uh You know, you don't feel like that. You feel like this unfinished business, or the cycle is not complete yet. You don't feel like it's completely done. And I think a part of you is waiting for this person. Could be done with a Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. So tell me about the Page of Pentacles for the person that Cancer is dealing with. Tell me about the Page of Pentacles. Tell me about the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, and the Eight of Swords. The person's feeling somewhat stuck in regards to communication. So there's a sense of wanting to communicate, wanting to come out, say, hey, how are you, blah, blah, blah. But this person's feeling somewhat stuck or unable to move forward in regards to that. They do want to come together, though. They do want to be more cordial and more friendly with you. Why is this Three of Pentacles there? Why the Three of Pentacles? What is this Three of Pentacles about? They don't, you know, for some, I don't know if this, maybe for some of you, this person's having some sort of money issues or whatever the case may be, but I really feel like they don't want to be single from this connection, but there's something here holding them back as to communicating here, all right, with that nine of pentacles and the three of pentacles upright. So I feel like a part of them definitely does want to be, they don't want to be single from this. They do want to come together with you. They do want to be on the same page or on the same level. But there's blocks in communication here. Why is the Seven of Swords for why is all happening? Why is the Seven of Swords for why is all happening? Ooh, somebody here is just non-committal. <sighs> it's all happening due to not being committed to the situation. 
okay someone here is not committed either they have more than one person in regards to this connection there's a lack of stability here as well someone is being sneaky and not being committed to to one person i guess or had they have commitment issues i don't know that's why it's all happening all right so how does cancer see the person that they're dealing with how does cancer see the person that they're dealing with how does cancer see the person that they're dealing with here See them as the page of wands. It keeps emphasizing communications. Like you really want to communicate with this person. You see this person as someone that you do want to get it off the ground with. You do want to come together with. You do want to have at least some sort of communication, even though if it's very immature communication. All right. Tell me about this page of wands. Tell me about the page of wands. Yeah, and the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So you you view this person as someone who's really not getting off their ass to communicate to come and communicate with you, or you feel like things are just taking forever in regards to communication with that Page of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles there. So you just see this person as someone who's really not moving their ass, who's not coming towards you to communicate right now at the current moment, or things are just really stagnated here, or really stuck or slow. All right, could be dealing with an Earth sign. So how does this person? Um, how does this person see cancer, please? How does this person see cancer? How does this person see cancer? They see you as the Five of Swords. Why is the Five of Swords here? What is this Five of Swords about? What is the Five of Swords about? Yo. So they see you as the Five of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. So, of course, an ending here. Okay, so they, they see you. I don't know if your person tends to be manipulative or they have manipulative tendencies, but they see you as someone who maybe plays mind games with you. Because usually, usually when someone has a hard time committing or they're like that, they tend to blame the other person. So I feel like maybe they, they view you as someone who's playing mind games or there's conflict with you. So they maybe they view you as someone that there's conflict with in regards to all this. Or maybe they think that you're the one who's playing mind games, but in reality you're not. All right, they also view you as the five of pentacles there. So I feel like they know that you missed them. It's like this cockiness, like I know I know that cancer misses me, or whatever the case may be. But I kind of do feel like there's some sort of level of them that does miss you as well. I'm not really getting a whole huge like cups here. I don't I feel like your person does want to talk to you. They do want to get on the same page, but they're not taking any initiatives because somebody here is really not they're not committed to the situation. I feel like you want this more than they do. They're like, hey, yeah, okay, whatever, I'll talk to you. But you're wanting to come together with them emotionally while they're they they while you they see you as the five of swords and the five of pentacles. But they see the situation as conflict or there's just a lot of drama or conflict. But I think maybe deep down they do miss you or they and they do know that you miss them. But I'm not really getting like a lot of love coming from this energy at all. If anything, it, it, there's more than one person here. There's a lot of game playing. There's a lot of non-committal energy here. You're waiting on someone who really could care less about being in a relationship with one person. Alright. So, um... It's kind of like maybe your person definitely does want to have their cake and they definitely do want to eat it too. Tell me about this Eight of Swords and the Moon in Reverse, yeah. Why is that Moon in Reverse for the Ten of Wands? So I don't know if there were secrets or something here that was revealed that caused some sort of a burden here between the two of you, for some of you. So what's the possible outcome here? What's the possible outcome for this situation? What's the possible outcome for the situation here? Kind of like friends with benefits type of like thing that this person's kind of like into. So, um, what's the possible outcome for the situation, please? What can you tell me? What's the possible outcome for now until the end of um, August? The King of Swords, okay. Star reverse. Could be done with an Aquarius, okay? Doesn't have to be. 
to be embodying the East and West. So it doesn't get off the ground between the two of you. So, and I feel like you're going to start to lose hope and faith in the situation that it could ever get off the ground. Okay, um, why is all this happening for the outcome? It's all happening to, because things weren't successful in the past. Someone here really does feel bad about, or they, they're disappointed about this. <sighs> So it's kind of like it's all happy to the Six of Wands in reverse, so because it just it wasn't successful or whatever it is that you thought you wanted with this person or you, you still want, it's not getting off the ground or it's not being successful or a situation failed. And I feel like there's a lack of a new start here happening between the two of you. And I, I your person, it could be you or the person that you're dealing with, they, don't, they tend to not show their feelings or emotions. You may hear from them. Because they were the king's of swords, but it just won't go anywhere. And I feel like you're going to either lose hope and faith in the connection that you can even get it off the ground. Because I'm not seeing this being successful with that, sig that six of wands in reverse there. Okay, so it just doesn't get off the ground. And it's like you're, you're kind of like in this energy of, well, will it ever happen? Like, you know. Anyway, so that was your that was your um, reading on Cancer of Resonated. Please like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Let me know. Thank you for watching. And hopefully I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.